Bristol Community College, Mathematics with Dan Avedikian, Math 060, Topics in Developmental Mathematics, Section 4.10, Problem 14. This is Section 4.10, Problem 14. It says Jessica is 5 feet 6 inches tall. Using information from previous problems in this homework, calculate her height in centimeters. So typically what we want to do is take the given information, 5 feet 6 inches, and multiply it times some type of a number 1 so that my units will cancel that I'm given and, and other units will show up. Well, what makes this problem a little different right from the beginning is I have two units of measure. I'd like it all to be in feet or all to be in inches. And I can do it either way. Um, you might know that the six inches would make this five and a half feet. But what I had in mind is if you go back to, I think it was problem four, it tells you that 12 inches equals one foot. So what I'd like to do, I want to have it all in inches because from problem 13, I know that 2.54 centimeters equals one inch. So I kind of have to work with what I know. The previous problem gave me a centimeter inch conversion, so I'd like all of that to be in inches. So six inches is already in inches. The five feet is not. Let's make five feet into inches. So I have five feet feet and I want to multiply that times something that has feet on the bottom. So it'll cancel. I want inches on the top. So from problem four, I have one foot is equivalent to 12 inches. Now if I multiply that out, feet in the numerator, feet in the denominator, cancel. I should have put one foot maybe is better English, but in terms of the math it's okay. I have 5 times 12, and my units will be inches. So 5 times 12 is 60, so I have 60 inches. So Jessica is 5 feet 6 inches, so that's 60 inches and 6 inches. Well, now the 60 inches and 6 inches, everything is in inches. I have 66 inches. Now I want to convert that to centimeters, but again in problem 13 I have a conversion ratio to go from centimeters to inches, or vice versa. So that's going to get multiplied by a fraction. What goes in the denominator should be what I need to cancel my units of measure. So I should have inches in the denominator and centimeters in the numerator. And I just abbreviate the centimeters. CM is the standard abbreviation for centimeters. So to make those equivalent, one inch is the same as 2.54 centimeters. Now, when I multiply, inches in the numerator, inches in the denominator will cancel. I have to figure out what 66 times 2.54 is, and my units of measure will be centimeters. That's something you probably want to do on a calculator. If you run that through your calculator, you will get 167.64. Your units of measure will be centimeters, which is what you want. It says Jessica is 5 foot 6 inches tall. How tall is that in centimeters? In centimeters, that would be 167.64 centimeters tall.